today we take few more problems on ellipse the first problem is let b be dashed and a a dashed are major and minor axis of x square by a square plus y square by b square is equal to 1 b square is greater than a square p is any point on it p is any point on it whose ordinate is pn if e is eccentricity of the ellipse then value of a n into a dash n by p n square is options 1 plus e square 1 plus e square by 2 1 minus e square and 1 minus e square by 2. So here a standard equation of an ellipse is given. Uh, in this case, b square is greater than a square. So this is major axis. So its shape is of that type. Minor axis and this is major axis. A dashed A, B, B dashed. P is any point on it. P. Its ordinate is Pn. Now, we have to find An, A dash N and Pn square. Pn is known. Suppose coordinate of P is A cos theta. B sin theta. So that we get Pn P to N Y coordinate of P that is B sin theta. Suppose this is O A N A a n this is o a minus o n o a means a minus o n is x coordinate of p that is a cos theta a dash n a dash n is a dash o plus o n a plus a cos theta now putting all these things here a n by a n into a dash n by p n square is equal to a into 1 minus cos theta a n a dash n is a into 1 plus cos theta by p n square Pn is your b sin theta, b square sin square theta is equal to a square, they together is 1 minus cos square theta, that is sin square theta by b square, sin square theta, so that it is equal to a square by b square. Now, for this case, e square answers when options all options are in terms of e so we have to convert this in terms of e e square is equal to as because it is b is greater than a it is equal to 1 minus a square by b square so that this value is equal to e square minus 1 1 minus e square this is equal to 1 A square minus b square is equal to 1 minus e square so that it is equal to 1 minus e square 
So this option is correct. That is option C is true. So take our next problem. The focus of the ellipse x square by 9 plus y square by 1 is equal to 1. Subtain a right angle at the point P, not necessarily on the ellipse. Subtain a right angle at the point P, locus of P is x square plus y square is equal to 2, x square by 2 plus y square is equal to 1, x square plus y square is equal to 8, x square by 2 plus y square is equal to 1. These are the options. Achha, in this case, our well, standard equation is given standard equation of ellipse is given major axis is along x axis minor axis is along y axis so in this case the given the inform given informations are this is s and s dashed p is any point somewhere it may be within the within the ellipse or outside or on the ellipse. Now the P, the point P is such that this is 90 degree. Now let us take P and say XY. So we have to find a relation between X and Y in known terms. Focus, I mean, we have to find out focus S and S dash for that purpose, E square is equal to 1 minus B square by S square. So it is equal to 8 by 9. So E is equal to 2 root 2 by 3. S is A E comma zero two root three comma zero S dash is S dash is minus two root three comma zero. So as per condition this angle is ninety degree, therefore gradient of PS and gradient of P S dash their product must be minus one. So, gradient of PS is equal to, this is Y minus 0 by X minus AE. AE means 2 root 3. 2 root 3. Gradient of PS dash is equal to Y minus 0 by x plus 2 root 3. So from the fact that product of the gradients is equal to minus 1, we have y by x minus 2 root 3 into y by x plus 2 root 3 is equal to minus 1. That is y square is equal to x square minus uh, 4 into 3. 2 root 3. Uh, it is x square minus 4 into 3, 12. So, oh, oh, this minus 1 is there. So, x square plus y square is equal to 12. 
but x square plus y square is equal to 12 is not there. So anyway, this is the process. I think answer will be x square plus y square is equal to 12. Or it may so happen that in calculation, some mistake is done. May, maybe. So for that purpose, you simply process is this. You simply check the uh, calculation. Otherwise, answer is that. Next question. A point on x square plus 3y square is equal to x square plus 3y square is equal to 6 situated in the first quadrant whose distance from root 6 comma 0 is root 3. Eccentricity of the point is no, not that eccentric angle of the point is how much? Options are pi by 4, pi by 3, pi by 6, and pi by 2. So, this is a ellipse. Its equation is in standard form zero. So major axis, minor axis of that type. It is such that distance if P is a point in the first quadrant on it whose distance from root 6, 0. Root 6, 0 is here. Root 6, 0 is root 3. Eccentric angle. Suppose the coordinate of P is A cos theta. B sin theta. So, theta, if can be obtained, theta is the eccentric angle of P. We have to find that eccentric angle. So, theta. We have to find theta. Given condition is that point is say Q. PQ is equal to root 3. PQ square is equal to root 3 square is equal to 3. PQ square is root 6 minus root 6 cos theta whole square. Root 6 minus root 6 cos theta whole square plus 0 minus root 2 sin theta whole square is equal to 3. So that 6 into 1 minus cos theta whole square plus 2 into sin square theta is equal to 3. Sin square theta 1 minus cos square theta. So that we get 6 into 1 plus cos square theta minus 2 cos theta plus 2 minus 2 cos square theta is equal to 3. So that we get 4 cos square theta, 6 cos square theta minus 12 cos theta plus 6, 6, 8, 8 minus 3 plus 5 is equal to 0. 
just one minute. Four, twelve cos theta, and it is six, eight, five, twenty. So four cos square theta minus ten cos theta minus two cos theta plus five is equal to zero. That is two cos theta into two cos theta minus five minus one into two cos theta minus five is equal to zero. So that we get. Two cos theta minus five into two cos theta minus one is equal to zero. We get two values of cos theta. One cos theta is five by two, more than one, rejected, not possible. Other value of cos theta is half. Cos theta is equal to half. It is situated in the first quadrant, so. Cos if cos theta is equal to half, then it is sixty degree. Theta is equal to sixty degree. Hence, our that option is correct. So let us take our next problem. Equation of diameter of three x square plus four y square is equal to five, which is conjugate to y plus three x is equal to zero. Is it is option sir. 3x is equal to 4y. 4y is equal to x. 4x is equal to y. 4x is equal to 3y. In this case, one ellipse is given in standard form. Its equation is in standard form: x square by five by three plus y square by five by four is equal to one. So its major axis is this, minor axis is that. So it is of that type. Say, drawing is like that. This is. Center. Suppose one diameter of it is that, that. So y is equal y plus three x is equal to zero. Suppose we and we have to find the diameter conjugate to that, conjugate to this. Let it be. Y is equal to m x. Its gradient is minus three. Its gradient is m. Right. So we get product of the gradients is equal to minus b square by a square. Five by four by five by three is equal to minus three by four. So that we get m is equal to one by four. Three cancels. M is equal to one by four. So equation of the diameter conjugate to that is equal to y is equal to one by four. One by four into x. That is four y is equal to x. So this is correct option. Now. The next problem.
if lx by a this is l lx by a plus my by b is equal to 1 sorry not 1 this is n passes through end points of a pair of conjugate diameter of x square by a square plus y square by b square is equal to 1 then the value of l square plus m square is options n square 2 n square n square by 2 n square by 4 it's base it is given the one ellipse is given in standard form and this is a lx this passes through in points of a pair of conjugate diameters of that suppose this is the ellipse this is a pp dash qq dash these are pair of conjugate diameter suppose p coordinate of p is a cos theta b sin theta so that of q will be a cos of pi by 2 plus theta for conjugate diameter that theta is increased by pi by 2 comma b sin theta pi by 2 plus theta is equal to minus a sin theta b cos theta now given that this line passes through p and q then we have to find the value of this in terms of n and other constants so as because this passes through p so putting x is equal to a cos theta x by a is equal to I mean, l cos theta plus y by b I and mean, y by b is equal to uh, b sin theta so it is equal to m sin theta minus n is equal to 0 number 1 now putting it also passes through q this one so it become minus this become l by x by a is equal to l minus l sin theta plus m cos theta minus n is equal to 0 so that m cos theta minus l sin theta i write cos theta below cos theta sin theta below sin theta m cos theta minus l sin theta minus n is equal to 0. Now from these two solving for sin theta and cos theta by cross multiplication we have cos theta by minus mn minus ln is equal to sin theta by minus mn plus ln is equal to
1 by minus L square minus M square so that we get cos theta is equal to n into l plus m divided by l square plus m square cos theta and sin theta is equal to n into l plus m divided by minus l square plus m square now treating uh, with the property that sine square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 we get 1 is equal to cos square theta plus sine square theta is equal to 1 is equal to n square into L plus M whole square by that whole square plus N square into L plus M whole square by L square plus M square whole square so that we get L square plus m square whole square is equal to n square into l plus m whole square Dano. I have mistaken somewhere l plus cos theta plus m sin theta minus n is equal to 0 that is okay so we get cos theta by minus l n cos theta by minus m n that m sin theta by sin theta by minus m n n l l n is equal to 1 by l square plus m squared with negative sign so that Actually, answer become L square plus M square by L plus N is equal to N. So, or next day I will tell you that problem. Or rather, you check the calc all calculations of all, all, all these things you check. You, you can get answer. As per my record, its answer will be n square yes next problem The distance of minus 2 comma root 2 comma 4 by 3 distance of the point from directrix of 16 x square plus 9 y square is 144 
directrix of that lying in third and fourth quadrant is how much so this is actually in standard form it is x square by 9 plus y square by 16 is equal to 1 so this is major axis this is minor axis it is of that type x axis y axis it has two directrices one is that other is that we have to find the distance of that point from the directories of that lying in third and fourth quadrant this directrix lies on third and third and fourth quadrant this one not that and minus 2 4 by 3 is the point so somewhere there minus 2 root 2 4 by 3 so we have to find the distance from this to that so this distance means that distance plus this distance it is this distance is 4 by 3 plus that distance is actually the distance of the uh, directrices uh, from x axis so for that purpose its eccentricity become is root over of 1 minus a square by b square that is root 7 by 4 and that equation is x uh, i mean y is equal to b by y is equal to uh, b b by e that is equation of that is x either x is equal to a by e or b by e b means 4 by e into 4 so that 16 by root 7 so now this distance is 16 by root 7 that distance and that distance is 4 by 3 this one y coordinate so required distance is 4 by 3 plus 16 by root 7 this is correct option oh, options i have forgotten this is the correct, correct option okay okay so today is after this i request you to like the video share the video and subscribe my video thank you